What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Road to Glory, and this is actually going to be the final episode of our freshman season at Clemson. Now it was it's crazy. I feel I think I was just I was just uh, fin like recording my uh, my last episode for my high school uh, senior year, like not too long ago, like a week, two weeks ago, which it's insane how like quick we're flying past these seasons. Now, I didn't expect to get past this season so quick, but we're going to be playing against a number 23 UNC, who are 9-3. They have the best running back in the nation, I just learned. So, we're just going to hop right into it. Now, we are actually playing at Baltimore's Field um, against UNC. Now, they're the away team, so they pick. UNC is also another school I would contemplate going to, but um, I'm actually not going to... I wasn't thinking about going there. I like their unis and I like their colors, but um, other than that, there's really not much I like about that. Now, let's start off coming out of the gates hot by getting a really long touchdown for Dixon, like we're going to do right here, which uh, I don't know if it's going to be a touchdown, but it's going to be a good catch. Now, I forgot to talk about this last episode, but my videos are doing fantastic. My channel's doing fantastic. Um, I just hit, uh, usually, like, for I can see my stats for, the month, for like, the current month that I'm in, but um, for the, the last 28 days, I have 1,200 minutes of watch time, which I've never hit over a thousand i don't think i've even hit over like 500 for a month so considering the fact i made it to um a thousand in one month that blows my mind it, it really does i'm just glad that we have progressed the way we have and i also have like um a thing that's like downloaded into my chrome it's called vid iq and it can tell me how many views i have had in the last 60 minutes last 48 hours um and whenever i check like the vid iq it it literally that's a really good catch as a clutch catch too but every time i check the vid iq it always like how many views i've had in the last 60 minutes i always have at least like more than three in there and we were thinking like three views that's like kind of shitty but i a lot of the times i don't even get views like ever on a video i can name multiple videos where i don't have like a single view on the video like i know um a gta campaign video still doesn't have any views that's from nearly two years ago Again, still doesn't have a view. Um, one of the beta videos for Black Ops 4 doesn't have a single view on it. Now, considering I'm getting like pretty good views now with the Road to Glory, and I knew that I would be getting these kind of, these kind of views for the Road to Glory because it's pop. I also like within a day or like 40. No, it was like within 48 hours, I got like nearly 170 views on like just overall out of all my videos. Now they're blitzing me. Oh my god, that hurt. So I just wanted to say thank you. Uh, I hit I've gotten like six subscribers this month, which is the most I've gotten in a month um, without like like in the past I've I've uh, you know made a like for instance I made a league on Call of Duty and I said like I put in the discord chat I was like hey by the way while you're here like subscribe to this like I think I got like nine subscribers in a month but like without telling anybody to subscribe to me I've gotten six subscribers this month so I am it's insane it's kind of weird to think that uh, my goal was 100 subscribers, like, in total last month, or last month, last year, and I, um, it's a it would actually be kind of possible with this series and how good this series is doing, so, again, thank you very much for watching, and, uh, thank you for the support you alls have been giving me. I mean, I guess I could do kind of like that Dixon glitch I was talking about last time, but the difference is, it's like... It, it really only works when they're doing one-on-one -on -one coverage and they are playing like really close to the wide receiver Which they are usually doing sometimes like that. Okay. See right there That shouldn't have been a catch because like he, he wasn't playing close to the receiver nor was he I mean Overton's not that fast. So I don't it's really sad There's nobody good in the actual uh, ACC like the only good team possible good team is Miami and they're not really that good now We're gonna do a read option. Oh, yes one thing I do I do like about the the cha the conference championships games is like the end zone the end zones it's like the dumbest stuff. Okay, I have a confidence that I could break that tackle, but I couldn't. It kind of looks like a face mask. But I like how the end zones look. Like they color them in all the way. Like for instance, our end zone at our field, it's like it's basically the same thing. Like the, with the like, like with the light the white. Can I speak? And second of all, can you like stop like stop stop running like that? Whoever like the RB that I was gonna throw it to, like let him stop stop. And then he stops again, and then he's like, you know, maybe I should run. Either way, it's a split. It's a split, uh, split fans here because, um, we are in, wow, dude, oh, that kind of hurt. Okay, mama ain't raised no biscuit, though. Um, you know, I bullet, well, North Carolina, of course, is in North Carolina, but, uh, 
I kind of have to do this. I got to do this play or I'm not going to be running the ball. So, Oh, but I can call an audible. Forgot about that. Can't do that in this game. Moy B N. I'm going to change A's route and make it just a uh, in route. Uh, maybe I'll make it a slant. No, I'll make it an in route. Okay. Now I'm going to hike it. And there you go. Touchdown. All right. So we are up 21 to 7 against UNC. We haven't had any problem with them. Uh, I'm not too concerned about this game at all. I, I did say, oh, but the Butterfingers. Gotta love them. I said the same thing about uh, the Maryland game, and we went down by 14. So maybe I shouldn't, like, say that. But who? where's Dixon? You're, you're lined up on that side. You're playing. He's kind of playing close to him. So, uh, but they are going to double stack him. Come after me. There you go. That's kind of what I wanted. Um... Yeah, I guess that's kind of what I wanted. <laughs> so I've been super uh, hyped about my channel doing good. I've been in a super good mood. So when I'm in a good mood, it's a good thing. Um, there you go. Okay, cool. Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> of course. We are making kind of stupid decisions this game. We've been making them last game too, or like last episode. So we need to clean those up a little bit. Because uh, especially when we get to whatever bowl we get placed in, because we're 100% probably not going to be placed. 100, what am I saying? Probably. We're 100% not going to be placed in the national championship, sadly. But um, whatever bowl we are placed in, we're going to have to play smart because it's going to be another good team. Like, UNC is ranked, but they're not good. I mean, we're plying. We're plying. Yep, we're plying. We're uh, plowing through them. So, I don't think... That's a really fast... Uh, Linebacker. I tried. I okay. I almost just fumble right there. I tried sliding. I think my guy was like right. I think he was starting to do the animation, but it didn't. It didn't. <laughs> now Johnson should be open over the middle. Just, uh, it just depends on how the defense collapses in and how that corner decides to play him. Now slide, slide, slide. Ryan should be open left side of the field. He also is our our hot receiver or whatever, whatever that means. There you go. Touch Hey, we broke a record. Our school passing touchdown record for a career. Now they want to run, but to be realistic here, uh, I have 100% faith that we can score in 58 seconds, especially since that corner is playing really closely to Dixon. So uh, we're, we're just going to get a touchdown with Dixon right there. <laughs> that's lit. That's lit. That's lit. Touchdown, Dixon. 70 yard touchdown. All right. So third quarter, we're beating UNC royally. Uh, again, we should be able to come out of here leading by a lot that's not going to change anywhere that we rank i don't believe unless ohio state magically gets beat by northwestern even though uh, it said alabama didn't have a conference championship i think it they do maybe it's not this week maybe it was just a glitch that's it that could be it too but um i probably shouldn't have relied on x to get open that probably wasn't my smartest okay slide 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 slide, slide. it didn't work but it's all right it's all right first and 10 at like the 32 or something like that i can't i can't read right now but why should be 100% be open if that guy put his arms out? That could have been a pick, 100%. I've also upgraded to a three-monitor setup. So um, there's some new stuff going on. I feel more professional. I'm getting uh, getting some good views, getting some good subs. Uh, i am got a new setup. I mean, everything's kind of going my way recently. I'm kind, of, I'm kind of happy about that. And just look at the teams on that back wall. There is literally nobody that is good in the ACC. That is kind of... That kind of uh, demotivates me. Uh, like if I think of going to like an ACC. What was that? Let me see this again. Wait a minute. What is that? <laughs> wait, what? Wait, 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 wait a minute. None other but my man Dixon. Am I right though on that play? That was insanely weird and cool. And I don't even know what that was to be quite, to be quite honest. I'm kind of scared though that Dixon's like a senior and we're not going to be able to play with him after... Our next game he's like look at him it's not like yeah that that could be a glitch in the game but like no other receivers able to do that only him being so fast so i hate to say this but um we're kind of almost beating uh clumps or not clumps we're beating ourselves yeah we're kind of almost beating unc by as much as we were beating the cupcake team um that is embarrassing let's start oh my god he's open he's open he's open He's a skinny boy. He doesn't get time. Mylon Richard, where'd you come from? Ooh, triple option. Love these. They're like super swaggerific. 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 Same thing. Because there's so much handing off and 
There you go. Uh, if you can break a tackle, you're in the end zone. Or just break some ankles. That's cool, too. Where's the clipping call? Give me the clipping call. Yeah, boy. Clipping call. Should be able to find Powell or Fields in the end zone on this play. So. And. That was, that was just kind of. That was a dumb throw, but it was. I guess it worked. We're actually going to run a jet play. Because last time we did this, it actually worked pretty well. So we're going to. We're going to run one of these plays. These are actually pretty good. Oh, never mind. It was not a jet play. It was. Okay. I, mm, okay. I, I had the thought in the back of my mind that it was an option play, but I was like, you know, maybe it isn't. I don't know. Because it wasn't popping up the little, like, letter thing. We're going to do it again. Because me running to the outer side, that was a dumb, dumb idea. So. Uh, 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 uh. Lay down. Dare me to do the same exact play. You won't because I'm going to. Let's fake hike. And then do the same exact play. Uh, uh. Okay, first one. Uh, we're going to see if we can get Dixon down deep. Down deep. <laughs> Uh, alliteration. Uh, we're gonna see if we can do that again. So let's throw it and hope. Never mind. Uh, let's go. Yeah, that's exactly what I was expecting that corner to do. Gotta love glitches, right? Man, I'm so curious. What team are we actually gonna get drafted to? I'm not. Uh, I'm thinking in the back of my mind, like, if I don't pick what team we get drafted to, um, I have a few teams in mind that I know pick, like, who they pick. Like, there's only a few teams that actually pick quarterbacks in the draft that need it. I'm not gonna say those teams because. I'll let you guys kind of figure that out when in like three more years after we are done with the the actual NCAA part of this this career. But oh, I was really hoping I'd be able to reach. And we're injured. Awesome. And are they going to take us out? They took us out for the rest of the game to make sure we were healthy for the next game. We ended with eight passing uh, passing touchdowns and we beat UNC in our conference championship, 63 to 27. All right, so we have won the ACC championship. That's a first for me. So um. That's the first time I'm actually getting the ACC championship trophy in my case. So let's add that. I actually don't know when you win high when it tells you if you win if you win if you won Heisman. Now we're gonna go to next week and actually go to bowl season. Hopefully, hopefully that doesn't say Orange Bowl, but like BCS Championship Bowl. So we'll see. Hey, and we do win the Heisman trophy in our freshman year. Hey, 2002. That's when I was born. But look at that stats. 2000 or. 202 passes out of 271 completions. Let me actually check what that percent. Actually, no, I don't want to do math. 5,005 yards, 117 carries, nearly 1,000 rushing yards, and 67 total touchdowns. Yeah, we deserve that. And we have won. Okay, well, I, I thought it was going to pop up the other trophies that we won. We've won the Maxwell Award, the Walter Camp Award, and the Davey O'Brien Award. I believe those are the only three awards that you can win as a quarterback. So... Uh, I mean, you could probably win defensive player. I mean, after that fumble, they have to give us defensive player of the year. So let's see where we actually, what bowl we actually get into. All right. So um, after Ohio State, Ohio State uh, beat Northwestern, they jumped up literally like five spots to play Boise State in the national championship game. Ohio State is actually about to win another national championship. Uh, Notre Dame uh, is also up there. So we're basically going to end sixth this season. Now, Texas A&M. Also went into OT against Tennessee. That's kind of scary, but um, yeah, this is a top 25. We're gonna go into our our game against. Uh, you'll see. Actually, uh, Ohio State. Well, you could see who we're gonna be playing. Well, Ohio State's not gonna be playing in the national championship bowl uh, against Boise State. Really, that should be Notre Dame against Ohio State. But uh, it's all right. I'm gonna get all these boosts just because. Um, you know. We're going to need it for this national championship game. We're going to need to play good. We're playing against Alabama. This is Alabama versus Clemson. Like, what is it, V4 now? So we're just going to hop right into it. This is a good game. All right. Oh, crap. Rain game. Oh, this is a terrible game to have a rain game. And I mean, I guess we did have a good game against South Carolina in the rain. So we'll see. So our defense was able to stop Alabama. That is the first, the first battle that we're going to have to fight. Second battle is getting warmed up especially we are in Miami so I guess uh, it should be relatively warm here but you know what I mean by getting warmed up Dixon probably was gonna I think Dixon was open downfield we probably could have gotten a crazy pass first play but again we're gonna have to play smart against Alabama this is literally like this is a rival of course we're playing Alabama um, in this this type of this caliber of game so let's see if we can play as well uh, as we have all season against just another crappy team like Alabama. All right, so we are very, we're already almost close to the end zone. So we're gonna, 
Oh, he possibly getting the end zone. First score against number four, Alabama, in the Orange Bowl. So our kicker managed to be uh, as good as the Browns kicker and missed the field goal. So uh, it's now 6-3. to three. They can t easily tie it up with the field goal. So um, we got to play a little bit smarter. We got to get in the end zone. We got to set the set the tone for this game. See, that's good. That, that pass to Powell, we're already setting the tone. We just can't fumble. We can't. Throw picks. We haven't thrown a pick in a while. Actually, no, we threw one against that cupcake team, but we're gonna ignore that. That doesn't count. I mean, how 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 much more perfect can you get for this game, though? This is literally Alabama, Clemson. I mean, these are the two best teams. I mean, realistically, in real life, even though Clemson smoked them. See, dropping balls, we can't do that in this this type of game. Now, coach wants to do a screen. I predict uh, we're it's gonna be third down here very quick. So, and unless he can get some crazy yards, which he. Let's get the first down. I was wrong. I, maybe that's what I got to do. I got to doubt my players and they'll actually like prove me wrong. Man, we're going to lose a million to zero. We are never going to win this game. It's, it, it works, I promise. It, it, I promise it works. It... Hmm. Let's throw that out. We got to play smart. Coach wants to do another screen pass. Man, that Al I always liked how the Alabama jerseys looked in this game. They look pretty nice. And they're going to look even better in, in NCAA 18, the mod for Madden 19. Or... NCAA, NCAA 19 and Madden 19, the mod for Madden 19 on PC. Now, I'm kind of mad because I don't own Madden 19 on PC, and I don't know if I'm I'm gonna buy it just for the mod. Maybe I will if it if it actually has some cool features, like they managed to mod in, um, like the playoffs. The they don't have all the teams, of course. They only have 32 teams because you you can mod to a certain extent. You can extent. Why did that sound super weird when I said it? you can mod to a certain extent? For instance, um, in Call of Duty, if you're able, if you're able to mod Call of Duty Black Ops 4, you can't just add specialists. You have to you have to edit the specialists that are already in the game. Like you can't just randomly add entities to the game. So it's not it's not their fault. That's just how modding goes. I I, I really don't know uh, a bit of coding. I actually know a little bit of coding. Uh, if you ask me to code like something on your screen, I probably wouldn't be able to do it because it was a while ago when I did it, but. It, I, I used to know how to code. Moral of the story. There you go. Touchdown, Higgins. Alabama was able to strike back. Now the score is 13 to 10. They're still, they're still close. This game is going to be close. I, I, I believe probably the whole game. So I don't want to let down on the gas pedal at all, or we might just happen to lose this game. Mess around and uh, like mess around like that and only get two yards on a play. For this play, Dixon should be open, especially with the speed gonna take a little bit though um, no they're actually rotating the field pretty nicely but he Overton is open and that's a 36 yard reception we're playing pretty good especially such uh, against such a good team this is probably the hardest team we've played this year because really Georgia wasn't that good we, they were just super overrated if you think about it um I just don't know how we got so unlucky with our ranking like uh, we get beat by at that time what we thought a really good Georgia team and uh, I don't know and we didn't even go up like that much like we've only I think we've only gone up like five spots this year like that's terrible uh, feed and bounds no he can't even catch it what am I saying Let's do that Ooh, that's a high pass and a bad bad pass I guess I should have like thrown it away because there was no way we were getting anything too crazy out of that now we have a deep tack for third down we're notoriously known for being good at third down and only being good at third down. So let's show that. Let's let's prove them right, I guess. There you go. First down. I told you we're good at we're good at third downs. Now first and goal. Look at your boy. His blood is pumping. Can we possibly, you know, cool it down here? You know what I'm saying? We need to cool it down. It is getting hot in here. Miami, it is raining, but it is hot for sure. That's a pick. Nope. Oh, but that is an injury. Alabama staying with us. Really, they, they would be ahead if they they scored in that first possession. They really were bad in that first possession. I'm going to send Overton over on a slant. And hopefully, Dixon will just get one-on-one -on -one coverage that whole way. Looks like he won't, but if he's fast enough, which he is, he's able to get a 49-yard reception. And we might be able to score before the, the one minute is over before the end of this half, which will put us ahead by quite a, or at least uh, like 10. And then we'll get the ball beating a next half, and that should put us ahead by... 17. I was about to do some crappy math. Now, that'll get us in the five-yard line with that 20-yard pass to Kendall Joseph. Coach wants us to do an option play, so we're going to follow his wants. 
but the, the the people that are blocking for me they really didn't want to they're like wait what's a what is a block i have no clue what a block is i'm just gonna run into this guy and then like run right off i think that's a fantastic idea but bryant should be in the end zone or one of these people that are on the right side or i'm gonna be in the end zone one of them nick saban he's kind of scrambling right now he's like you know we're about to go down by two scores and i'm like like how you, you're just assuming uh with because i'm just so good at this whole football thing and i'm even better i'm so good at this offense thing but i'm even better on the defensive side i mean you saw me hit that fumble what do you mean like i don't uh, actually that's kind of dumb let's yeah let's have him guard because he's he's basically just gonna have my back uh should get some yards right here if he's quick but 30 32 was able to catch up to him uh, with the help of i don't know what number that is you think about it we kind of had a crappy end of the season uh, most of our our games at the end of the season are cold and rainy very upsetting uh, i think that's dixon on the left side if i know that correctly um i believe that is and oh they the corner saw that the one-on-one -on -one coverage wasn't working out he rotated it over that's a good play by that corner all right i need options i i kind of i kind of not been giving myself options which is bad that muy bad oh first down i think that's dixon left side I do see some one-on-one -on -one coverage, but I'm, I think I'm getting kind of blitzed. Oh, okay, that's a pick. Oh, dude, we've been getting so lucky with only deflex this game. A lot of these should be picks. We're wasting a lot of time on this drive. That's very, very good, especially with a very good offensive team, very talented team like Alabama. Uh, Why should be open if I send him deep? If I send X deep, which... Uh, y should be open. There you go. That's just stuff you gotta know. Okay, we're not injured. We're actually the opposite. We are powered up. That that hit did nothing but like put more energy into me. It was insane how much energy that put me into it. Like, oh, B was wide open by a mile, but I want Dixon to get another touchdown. Hey, school receiving touchdown record. Uh, Dixon just beat his own record. Oh, wait, no, he... Wait, no, he didn't beat the record, but he broke the school record for receiving touchdowns. Nice. All right, so Alabama was not able to come back. Now, this is starting to look like the national championship game. So, um, we're going to run because we have feet. And don't fumble, don't fumble. Get down, get down, get out, down out of bounds, one of them. It's insane that we have that 90 speed. I don't see us, um, when we do go to the NFL, I don't see us slipping down at all. I'm like laggy. I'm like losing frames, man. Now we're to slide. I probably could have gotten a few more yards, but I want to stay safe, especially in this game. And fumbles, and it, fumbles are gonna be a lot more frequent because it's rainy. And I'm also like, I've been like doing this rushing offense. So, dude, why is my game so like framey? Kind of annoying. That was a dumb pass. I should have thrown it at a better time. I wonder next season they're gonna they're gonna give me number four because at the beginning of this season. They told me I'd come here to be a first string, and they also told me I'd come here to be, well, have number four as my number, which they gave me neither. They gave me number 18, which I like 18 better than four, personally, because that's like Peyton Manning's number and stuff like that. Uh, but, man, they, they told me I'd be a first string, and that's the reason why we're in this game right now. The reason why we're in this this game against Alabama is because they, they lied to me. They're like, you know what? You'll be the third string, so come play for us clemson ends we're gonna go for it because mom ain't raised no biscuit but they told me they're like first string promise you will be a first string if you come play for clemson but then they lied to us and we're uh, we were a third string and we were a third string against literally i gotta stretch never mind now yeah, that sucks and i'm injured nice while i was gone alabama only scored once so not much damage was dealt to us but um there still are two possessions away from I'm catching up to us so and if play smart uh he's open he is open dixon is open who would have guessed wow that is a touchdown awesome yes touchdown i'm kind of curious to see where we're going to be ranked at the beginning of next season uh just with all the teams that are higher ranked right now losing like ohio state or not i don't say ohio state's gonna probably lose but either boise state or notre dame is gonna have to okay let me let me let me rephrase that Boise State is gonna lose in the national championship game. So I mean, how far are they gonna drop? If they don't drop anything less than if they drop like two spots, I'm going to be mad. If they don't drop anything less than uh if it wait, what am I even trying to say? If they don't drop anything more than like five spots, I will be upset personally. 
Especially knowing that we are the getter. Okay, yeah. Fields, you have dropped so many balls this this season. You have dropped so many balls. I'm saying it straight, like right to your face. You have dropped so many balls this season. If you were a senior, bye bye. I don't care. Please don't go to the NFL. Nobody wants you on their team. I'm just I'm saying it right now. I'm getting angry now. I'm getting angry. Let's calm it down a little bit. So, oh dude, oh, I'm so mad. Just get in the end zone. That's all that matters. Touchdown. Coach wants us to run down the time, but really running down the time for us is just like getting touchdowns and and having the their their offense take it, have our defense fight it out in the the gridiron. So we're gonna have that. We're gonna have them do exactly that. Now let's see if we can get a good catch right there. We cannot, dude. That guy, the Alec Cajo. They're, they, he's been doing kind of good. He's been deflecting all of my stuff. So I believe this is an option play. No, oh, it is, but I'm not able to take the ball. So we're gonna have to flip it around a little bit because I'm not gonna let anybody have the ball by myself. There you go. That should maybe be a touchdown. It was nice. Hey, NCAA record passing touchdowns in a in a season. Awesome. We just beat the record. That's crazy. Who the heck is the is number Q, who, who the heck is the QB from Hawaii that broke it? Now they take us out of the game and we were able to win the Orange Bowl 55 to 31 against number 4 Alabama. So I'm going to skip to next season and see where we're ranked first first game of the season. So we're going to get right into that. Yes, we have added the Orange Bowl with all those beautiful oranges, juicy oranges to our trophy case. Can we see the outcomes of some of these bowls? I think we have to go to next week to the end of bowl season and we'll be able to see kind of what happened that's a really cool screenshot but other than that we have moved up three spots to number three in the ranking so i'm kind of curious let's see can we see bowl results yes exactly what i was looking for let's see what happened in the bulls so we don't care about this stuff the bottom bottom stuff okay so wow who'd have guessed boise state lost that's fantastic they did not drop five spots really upsetting the notre dame won another national championship uh, Oklahoma was able to beat Florida. We were able to beat uh, Alabama. Ohio State was able to come up on top against Stanford. Uh, who is the number one team right now? Oh, Notre Dame. I'm stupid. They literally won. Let's actually check out the top 25 before the uh, end this season out. Now, Virginia Tech is actually going to move into the top 10 for next season. Alabama drops down a lot of spots. Uh, TCU and Louisville are now welcome in here. Notre Dame, of course, is going to be number one after beating uh, Boise State. Thank God they're out of here. I hope they don't pop up next year. But hopefully, I'm going to actually skip to next season and kind of see if we have some some good teams that we're playing against. All right, so Dixon is a junior First, before we like move on. Dixon is a junior, so uh, we will have him next season. But other than that, that's kind of sad because... Uh, we're gonna be losing. We're gonna be losing everybody here soon. I mean, D. Johnson's the only freshman on this list. That's sad. Okay, so that actually just took five minutes. But uh, but our first game, which is gonna be next episode, is going to be against Georgia. Um, let's take a look at our season. So we have our cupcake week. Uh, we have a bye. We have Central Michigan, Florida State, another bye. Maryland Terps. They should be higher if their offense is still good. Um, Wake, NC State, UVA, at Georgia Tech, at Boston College, Syracuse is later in the season, South Carolina, and uh, our bye, and then conference championship. Now, the only teams that I'm that really isn't going to be is that are going to be a challenge this year are going to be the Terps, and then also, I mean, UGA. I don't think they're they're going to be too hot this season. But let's see if we can. We're actually 99 overall. I did not know that. Uh, let's see what this is. Might as well just spend it on this. Now we're we're basically a god i don't see or i didn't think we got anybody too hot from the the recruiting class that, ju that just came through oh, we got another freshman halfback which is kind of cool uh we don't care about full fullbacks we have we did not get another wide receiver yeah i don't care about tight ends and stuff after that so um i'm gonna end the episode here so we happen to win Heisman in this episode, go to the Orange Bowl and win it against number four, Alabama. We're ranked three now. Um, we're actually getting some recognition we deserve. So if you enjoyed this video, press the like button, subscribe if you're new, and that's all I got. See ya. That's all, folks.